According to flight control data, there were no signals from the controllers to Japan Airlines or JAL plane to abort its landing. It appears that both the pilots and the flight controllers were unaware of the Coast Guard plane's presence on the runway during the descent of Japan Airlines aircraft. Kyoto News reported that the Japanese Coast Guard aircraft is believed to have stopped on the runway approximately 40 seconds before the accident. Flight control data also indicates that controllers permitted the Japan Airlines jetliner to land on the runway while instructing the Coast Guard plane to head towards a holding point, which caused it to enter the runway, resulting in the collision. To recall, five out of six occupants of the Coast Guard aircraft died, while all 179 passengers on the Japan Airlines Airbus 8350 escaped unharmed and without serious injuries. Meanwhile, the lone survivor, the 39-year-old captain of the Coast Guard aircraft, said he was allowed to enter the runway. Reports say the rear of the Coast Guard plane suddenly brightened. Japan Airlines stated that it has provided all information to Japan's transport authorities investigating the tragic incident on Haneda Airport's runway. Meanwhile, the airline mentioned that the damage to the aircraft amounts to around 15 billion yen, even though it is insured. According to the Japanese Coast Guard, the accident involved aircraft was en route to Niigata Prefecture to deliver relief supplies to the citizens affected by the magnitude 7.6 earthquake that struck the Noto Peninsula.